What's up guys, General Incompetence here and welcome to episode 3 of the Saving the North Let's Play on Mountain Blade 2 Battlelord with the Realm of Thrones 5.0 mod. Um, thank you all again for your continued support of this series. I really, really appreciate it. And before we dive in, you know the script. Let's smash that like button, see if we can get this episode to over 100 likes. Leave me your comments in the comments section down below with all of your tactical hints, tips and suggestions. And of course, your sacrifice to the gods of the YouTube algorithm. I promise I do read them all. And finally, if you are enjoying this content, please remember to smash that uh, subscribe button and join us on our road to 2k subs we have rocketed towards 2000 subs um we're only about a hundred we're less than 100 away now um and there's a chance not only we could do it before my wedding uh late next month we could do it before the end of the bloody week so um yeah please join us on our journey um i'll promise i'll make it worth it anyway let's dive into the action so i've done a little bit of off camera work uh since uh episode two as you will see here, we now have a fully trained army. Everyone is now a Banner Knight or Knight's Watch Protector of the Realm, so we are ready to go north of the wall. We can get 30 new troops, so I want to make them... I want to see if we can get some giants. I've been told if you go right the way north um, that you can find them. I've never found them before, but I'm willing to have a look. So we'll get some free folk son of then. We'll see if we can get some giants, and then we'll head back um to the relative safety of the free houses and see if we can get some uh, some bolton flayers in training so um but before we do that there's a tournament here and we might as well give that a wee go that is what we've been looking for black heart that is a two-handed axe oh the, this is this what a perfect way to start the episode in fact for nothing else give the video a like for that come on that's an amazing start so all we have to do is win this tournament. There are four lords. Um, I've also been to... If Benjen Stark is here, I might look at how much he costs. Apparently, he's like one of the best rangers in the game. Yeah, Benjen Stark's here. Edson Tollett. Piper? Don't know. And Oris Galmarin. No idea. But that is the prize. Look at that swing damage. 123. That is what we're after right now. And we're up against the Night's Watch Defender to begin with with a two-handed sword. Let's see what we can make of them. Boom. I did have a couple of um, upgrades um, while I was doing my training. Um, we had one to two-handed. I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll show you after this. Let's see if I can remember what I got. Um, but I mean, at this stage, there are no big decisions to be made. It's a Tollard is down. Night's Watcher Leaps Ranger is down. That Master Crossbowman is down, and I'm assuming Benjamin Stark dropped at some point as well. Oh no, he didn't make it through. Of course. Right, things are looking good. Right, let's have him. One down, two down. Love it. The day is ours. Bosh. And into the final. Yeah, we'll win this because we've got a shield. Don't want to get too sloppy, but... Yeah. There we go. We have what we've been after. Let's go. Bit of cash. We're obviously getting less cash each time because our expectancy to win goes up every time we win a tournament. But still, a little bit of renown never hurt anyone, did it? It's certainly going to help. I think on our way back, because obviously once we're done um, north of the wall... And um, we're done, you know, trying to get some Bolton Flayers. We'll head back to the Westerlands to get some more Banner Knights. Um, it might be worth us stopping off at Winterfell to pay Rob... Excuse me, Rob Stark another visit. Um, right, okay, so... Let's move all this down. 
Or should we start off with a still start off with a lance? And then we can shift it to black art. Yeah, let's do that. Excellent. Good. Right. It's time, boys, girls, and other animals, to head north of the wall. We're going to go through the tunnel. There it is. I love the detail. In we go. And out the other side. We are now north of the wall. Right, let's head to Skirling. Oh, there's the old bear. Okay. A lot of this has probably been looted by the Lord Commander. Now, we will almost certainly come across some whites. And we are not going to be taking those bastards on. Because uh, we will not win. Unless they're out, like, they're already attacking another army and we think that we can make a difference and possibly even win, we're going to be leaving them well alone. We don't have any sort of army. There they are. Luckily, they're very slow. If I just pause for a moment, let's see what they have. So, they've got three white walkers. So, the ferocious whites, the fearsome whites aren't as good as the ferocious whites, I don't think. I think ferocious whites are like the upgrade. And then they've got white walkers. They haven't got a night king. But those white walkers are just crazy. And if you try and um, defeat their hideouts, you will get to the end duel. But then you'll have to face the night king. And yeah, you ain't winning that. Right, let's have a look at our wee upgrades, shall we? So, what did I get? Yes, so I got an upgrade to two-handed weapon. And I decided to go with plus ten damage to two-handed axes and maces. Because I knew the kind of playthrough that we were going to go for. Riding, I'm pretty sure we had this upgrade, and I decided to go for mount speed and party speed over... I mean, we're not going for to being a horse archer for once. Um, and we're not... Horse archers aren't really part of our plan. Um, so I went for speed, scouting. Uh, I decided to go for plus two on steps and planes. Um, not sure... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got. Sorry, I went for travel speed instead of uh, range of sight. And here we go, steward, what should we go for? So plus two daily experience for troops in your party and cheaper garrison wages or... Ooh, okay. I think... Um... Yeah, I think seven veterans. Because we want more militia in governed, governed settlements anyway, because we'll have cash by that point. And yeah, if it helps us get our more elite troops even more elite faster, happy days. Because we can offset that by the fact that in our tactics we're saying to give preference to the lesser experienced troops. And I believe further down the line, here we go, plus five experience to infantry in your party uh, for each enemy you kill with a two-handed weapon. Once we get that, that will help um, the lower end troops as well. Right. Let's get recruiting if we can. No, there's nothing here that we want. We want the free folk son of Then. So let's head towards Hardhome. Who knows, there might even be a tournament in Hardhome as well. Yep, there is. That's good news. Nope, nothing there that we want. So let's go to Hardhome. This, of course, being where Jon Snow sailed north. Um with Stannis' fleet from Eastwatch by the Sea, and they got ambushed by the Night King. Right, what are we going to have? A Then Tribesman Helmet. Right, well, that's probably something that we're not going to want, but it is what it is. If you wanted to kind of cheat the system a little bit um, with tournaments, what you should do is say, enter the city, save the game before you press Enter Arena. That's really important, because once you press Enter Arena, it will generate a prize for the tournament and it that prize is then locked in so if you save before you um you know enter the city save then click enter arena if you don't like the prize you can then reload the game you're already in the city click enter arena again and a new prize will be um unlocked and you can especially if there's like more than five lords uh, especially i mean if there's more than 10 lords then definitely do this and keep recycling it if you want to until you get the best possible prize like a horse or something like that if you really need the cash um, right, obviously we're going to wager. Eh, 33 hours is much better. Right, who is here? Will Waters. That's it. Alright. 
Let's go. Alright, let's take you out. If we can. There we go. Good. Our team is doing well. But we've just lost one. The greens are our main problem. So let's even that out a bit. There we are. Hey, leave my boy alone. Damn, I missed. I don't think I've ever played a tournament near night time like this. Or maybe it's because, you know, winter is coming. R.I.P. Ned. R.I.P. Sweet Prince. Oh, I missed. I think we've taken an arrow to either the wrist or the spear. And that's not, uh... That's not a euphemism. Come on. Ah! There we go. Little bit of showboating. Okay. On to the next. Who do we have? Oh, we've got a free for th free folk fen cannibal on our side. That's surely going to help. Oh. Luckily, we didn't take too much damage there. That is sometimes the danger of uh, the rounds that are purely on horseback. One big hit from a lance can change everything. And I'm pretty sure... Is that how we died in our first tournament in Lannisport? It might have been. Damn, my boy's been... He's been downed. Right, we're definitely through to the next round. But I've got a two-on-one, the greens. Bosh. You're mine, boy. Come on. Boom, and that's a level up. Wait, one handed is now 69. I'm so childish. Okay, back on foot, and we've still got our cannibal. Actually, no, we had an impaler, but never mind. Ah, oh, there's the cannibal. There we go, Bosh. Right, final round. Oh wait, we never had an impaler. It always was a cannibal. That's my bad. That's me being inattentive. That's a good start. Sorry, pal. You've been a good ally up to now. Boom. Right, let's sell that helmet. And move on. We need to do recruitment. That's a nice picture of King's Land here with the Faith Militant. There's Jamie Lannister. I thought those should be troops from the Reach though, not Lannisters. If I remember correctly, which I might not do, but there you go. Right, uh, trade. Ah, uh, 800. Could be worse, could be much better. That is a decent horse, and we can afford it. But do we want to be spending money on a better horse right now? Seeing as we can probably end up getting a much better one through a tournament at a later date anyway. Ooh. Ooh. That is it. That's too expensive, but a thin bronze axe. Jesus, look at that. Swing damage, 154. Well, we'll keep that in mind. One thing I probably could do with is a better shield. A Lordly Lannister Kite Shield. Mm. Same speed, only fight. No, it's not worth it, is it? 
Not worth it. All right. Let's do our upgrades. Uh, of course, it's a level up. Um, what do we want to dedicate to? A th hmm. Medicine's got a long way to go. Leadership and athletics. We'll go leadership first, and then we'll go for athletics. And we'll plus one to vigor, I think. Okay. Next is... No, we're not bothered about you. Ah, uh, I forgot to get Benjamin Stark, didn't I? What am I doing? I'm doing recruitment. God damn it. Okay, nothing there that we want. So let's go to Ice Cliff. No, nope, nothing doing here either. Where next then? Um, we want to go to a mixture of the Frost... We want to go to the Fen Valley... And we want to go to the Frostfangs camp. Um, but we'll circle around here first, I think. If it's easy enough to do. I don't know if there's a crossing. Someone said in the comments, the northernmost village. And I don't know if that means the Crow Cave. Or we'll check out the Crow Cave just in case. Because, I mean, who doesn't want giants? Oh, there's some more whites. Let's stay out of their way. Oh, that's only 40. Now, do they have... They have one White Walker. Oh, boy. That's so tempting. We just don't want to lose all the troops that we've just gathered. Uh, let's check out the Fearsome Whites. Are they... The, okay, so they're not... It's the Ferocious Whites that are worse. Oh... You know, I'm just, I really want to, but this is the sort of shit that I do that means in my private time. Um, oh, that's 38. But they've got three White Walkers. You yeah, know, that's the sort of shit that I do when I'm not recording. That means that I lose my entire army and everything goes to crap. So let's not do that. Not yet. If we had more Banner Knights... My, ah, here we go. Free folks out of then. All of that. Yeah, if we had, like, more cavalry... Um, and what have you, then I'd probably go for it. But we don't. And, it's, I mean, if they didn't have a White Walker, then we'd definitely go for it, but... Right, let's go to Croquet. Crowgrave, even. And then we'll go to the Then Valley. Come on, give me some giants. No, no giants here. I hope you guys aren't lying to me. I want me some giants. I've never found them in the Then Valley either. Some of you might be at home watching this actually raving at me, being like, they're right here or whatever. Put it in the comments, let me know. I'm here ready to learn. I also didn't know that you could click and drag when deploying troops. I need to give that a go. Um, hang on, none of these are what we're looking for. You know, of the, all the hundreds of hours I put into this game, I never knew you could form up troops by clicking and dragging Rome Total War style. Um, so, like, I could spread out my archers and thin out my cavalry. Never knew that. Makes me feel like an idiot. But this is how you learn. You listen to people that know things that you don't. Right, I'm still not finding any giants, but we have found ourselves another tournament. A scalpel with three lords. Well, that's not going to be no good, but we'll win it anyway. Oh, I really feel like I should have gone after that, that army that only had one white walker. Ah, uh, Actually, that's not a bad sword. Well, we'll win it and sell it. Long Spear of Reich, Shadow Cat. Ah, the Magnar of Fens. The one that Jon Snow puts a hammer into his head. Bosh! I fucking hate Thens. I think this could be challenging, given that I'm shite with a bow in this playthrough. Let's use our two-handed weapon. Save our buddy. 
There you go, pal. Got your back. Oh, he's on our side. That's alright then. Yeah, goosh. Oh, he got taken out. Alright, let's see if we can shoot some people. Ow. Oh, we're in trouble. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Bitch. Partially blocked. Come on. Let's break through. There we go. Right, you guys are fucked, Al. I'm just, I'm like Boromir. Just full of arrows. How you like me now, dick? Right, next round. Oh, we've got a free folk sharpshooter. Great. Nice to see we've got some quality. Right, let's take out the Magna. Ouch. Come on, let's take out this guy quickly. Nice. Two on one. Nicely done, buddy. So we're definitely through to the next round. Shadow cuts down. Nicely done. Free folk sharpshooter coming through for us. Okay, semi finals. Okay, this is not ideal. At all. I'd hope I'd have at least taken one of them out by now. And it doesn't help that we're missing. Okay, come on. Good. Ow. Come on, love. Let's have it. Oof. Right, on to the final. Against Matey Boy, our sharpshooter. One more of those, I reckon. Come on. There we go. Got through in the end. Took a little bit longer than we thought, but never mind. That's another win. Hopefully, Scalpel might actually be worth a couple of grand, all said and done. Let's find out. Lots of tournaments, no battles yet. So we've won a tournament now at Castle Black, Hard Home, and the Fen Camp. What's it worth? Still under a thousand. It's annoying. Is it better than our sword, though? I mean, look at the swing cut damage. The swing speed is slower. And the thrust speed is slower, but much better damage. Worse handling, but I think we'll, ha I think we'll have that, you know? And we'll just sell the tapered blade. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Right. Um, yeah, there was nothing here. So what we want to do now is we want to head towards the Frost Fangs. So let's go towards the Fist of the First Men to start with. What is that? The Stark Caravan. Heading for... Hard home, interesting. Come on, give us a... Where are they going? 
patrolling around the fist of the first man. Okay. That's a big white army. There's Cotter Pike. I mean, if they went after a white army and they were involved, I'd, I would charge in. Okay, let's go to Cronest. Nope. Giant stair. Maybe there'll be some giants there. Who knows? Oh, that's a lot of whites. Is that Mance Raider? There he is. The king beyond the wall. No. Not what we want. If he goes after the whites again, we might join in and see what we can do. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, um... Oh, I don't think I've ever been to the frozen shore before. I'll tell you what, let's go down here. It's probably, like, nothing of interest, but... Nope, nothing there. I mean, that's probably how they get through to raid. Oh, there's another white army. Under a hundred. Yeah, they got one white walker. I think there's probably a white walker with everyone. If I see one below 50, I'm not going to pussy out this time. I'm going to go for it. Oh, look at all these. Nice. We might as well fill our boots while we're up here. Oh. Okay, 57. Again, let's... Get these. Right. No, two white walkers. Still no hint of a giant. I was promised giants. Are you guys lying to me? I know that they are obviously in the game. But so far, I'm not seeing them. Oh, we got quite close to the whites there. Oh, let's take out some broken men. We're not looking for a... Yeah, well, I am. And now we're just going to rejig our army around. I'd like to have infantry as class one. So, you are now going to be cavalry. You are going to be infantry. Where are my cavalry? What? Hang on. You need to have at least one more formation of this type. I don't understand. I'm so confused right now. Where are all my knights? Troops! Oh, look, there we go. There's the old click and drag. So why am I cavalry now? I I do not understand. And now it wants. I d I don't get it. Archers. Right, archers. Let's spread you out. Move. And then, if someone can please explain to me what the hell is going on. That would be great. I've never had this issue before. Move. And we've got Bananites interlaced with our Fens. And that shouldn't be the case. Um, yeah, what the hell is going on? Soldiers. Yeah, look. Why are they mixed in like that? Charge. I want to be able to separate my cavalry from my infantry. I've never, ever had that kind of problem before. So if someone can explain what the hell's going on, that would be great. But in the meantime, let's use our axe for the first time and see what we can do. Boom. Oh, this is what I've been waiting for. Oh, cool story, bro. Oh, it's just, it's beautiful. 
I know I should be leaving my troops to do all that, but whatever. Yeah, fine, we'll capture. I've been told I need to be capturing all troops and actually be bothering with it to sell them. So I shall now do that. Okay. Well, that didn't quite go to plan. I am not sure why that is happening. Maybe we need tactics to be higher. I don't I don't know. I've never seen that before. Um Hmm. Yeah, cavalry, archers, infantry. Yeah, someone explain that to me, please. Help a brother out. Right, I am not seeing any giants there either. Right, let's go to the frost fangs. Maybe we'll have another tournament. No, not this time. Ah, here's 1-1. One, one. Osher's there as well, but let's talk to 1-1, one, one, see if we can get him. How much? Oh my goodness, that's so expensive. Oh boy. We knew 1-1 one, one would be expensive, but at least we can now like send a raven to him. That's the main thing. Okay, we need some more food. Um, what should we get? Let's top up our fish. Top up our grain. Let's have a little bit of everything. Yeah, it's going to cost some money, but... Morale. Yeah, okay, fine. I think that for the moment we're done north of the wall. Again, I don't see any giants. There's no, there's nothing up here in the land of always winter. That's just blank. Um, at least I don't think you can get... No, yeah, it's all blanked out. Okay. Um, well, let's start heading back towards Castle Black. Let's just quickly search Giant. I mean, they're there. An Elder Giant. Jesus Christ. I mean, they are... Look at the armor as well. It's like having an army of 1-1s. One and those archer giants aren't bad either, are they? Giant arrows. Look, I mean, that's insane. But how do we get them? That's what I want to know. Where are they? Okay, we're near the fist of the first man. Let's head towards now Crastus Keep. Oh, hang on, here we go. I think oh, we kinda have to, don't we? They've only got one White Walker. Alright, come on then. Let's do it. You best back off. Oh. There's more of us hiding. Just waiting for our seat. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, this is it. This is our first battle against the Whites. Against the real enemy. Under my command! Oh okay, look, here we go. That Problem sorted. Cavalry is now separate. Cavalry! Good. Move! And... Archers! Archers, we're going to start you in front. Forward! So you can get some Forward! shots off. Soldiers, move! Go. Oh boy, Forward! the music. Move! Right, we ideally want to take this White Walker out. Cavalry, get to the flank. Infantry, Infantry. charge. Cavalry, Attack! 
go after the white walker oh you can hear them oh we lost the fen right that's it now everyone Everyone, just someone kill that White Walker. If we capture him, we might try and recruit him. That'd be quite fun. I think we just... We have to unhorse him because he's so fast. That's for sure. So if he runs into a tree, it might be best to just go after his horse. Like that. Well, the main thing is we took out his troops, no problem. Right. Ah, oh, no, we're too slow. Come back. Oh, he's just getting away so fast. Yeah, at some point, he's got to turn around and charge at us. Come on. Damn. He's caught. Ah, take him out. He's there. Where are our infantry? I have no idea. They're over there. Come on, come on, come on. Hit another tree. Yeah, if our archers can pepper him with arrows as well, that would certainly help. Come on. Get the horse. Ah, I'm too slow. Cavalry, get him. Ah. Oh, boy. Off he goes. Okay, come on. Circle back round. Ah, uh, hit his horse. Go on, cavalry. Archer's gone. Well, we did some damage to his horse. Here he comes. Hopefully he's circling back round. That is... I mean, his horse has surely gone over here on its last legs now. There we go, he's on horse, now we'll get him. There we go. Vamos, we only lost one man. Ooh. Look at all these upgrades as well. And look at that, we can capture a white walker. Well, we're definitely doing that. That goes without saying. This is going to be expensive. Nice. Whew. Ooh. Those are good. Some good boots. We'll have those. Some good mittens. We'll have that. Decent loot. Thank you. Oh, we did it. We survived going straight at the White Walkers. I'll sign for it. Alright, let's get back to the safety of Castle Black. I need to remember not to get rid of all the prisoners straight away. Um, okay, let's have a look. Fervent Attacker, plus four starting morale when attacking. And better recruitment of lower tier prisoners. Or more morale when defending. And yeah, I want to be able to recruit higher tier prisoners faster. Especially now we're going to try and get ourselves a White Walker. And let's definitely avoid this army. Okay, I'm just going to briefly pause because uh, something is going on that's setting the dogs off. One moment. Sorry about that, ladies and gents. Let's get ourselves back to Castle Black. And there's another tournament. Look, we might as well. But 
first. Choose which prisoners. Get rid of these. And keep that white walker. And what else do we want to do? Let's go trade. Good. Making some good money off that. Nice, nice, nice. That's the value. If you can take out some of those White Walker armies, they are worth their weight in gold. Um, okay. Let's see what we're working with. That's a horse, I think. I don't think it's a particularly high value one, but still hopefully be worth a few thousand. Boost the coffers. A camel. Great. Alright, Benjamin Stark is here. Pipas here. Oris Glymos, uh, Galmar and... Ugh. Can't get my words out. I'm still here. Let's go for it. I'd say this has been a successful episode, although there haven't been a ton of battles. We've got what we wanted in terms of troops. We have captured a White Walker. We've won several tournaments, and our armor is better than it was. So I'm claiming... I'm claiming a good episode. Nice. Boom. Alright, we are losing teammates fast. That's another one gone. Yeah, the reds are going to be our main problem. All still to play for right now. Ah, uh, there we go. Wait, we are the Reds. What am I talking about? I'm talking nonsense. Boom. Take that, Uncle Benjamin. Okay. Yeah, we probably should go after the Greens first, given that Benjamin's in there again. Make a mistake. Come on. Damn it. I made the mistake. Ow. Okay, we're safely through to the next round. Come on. You two are starting to annoy me. Come on. I don't think I'm going to win this one. God damn it. I just couldn't get going. Okay, semi-finals. Where are they? Oh, there we are. Look at the neck. And finally, who's last? A horseman. That was a much better first hit. Alright, let's finish it off. There we go. Victorious once again. Ah, satisfying. Lovely. Right. 
trade. Okay, it's worth a reasonable amount. It's actually better than my current horse, but do I really want to ride a camel? Like, really? I think I'd rather have the cash right now. I'll get a better one later. Good, good, good. Right, I think that is where we are going to wrap things up. So, just to recap, we started the episode with just pure um, Westerlands Banner Knights and Protectors of the Realm. We finished it with a ton, 29 now, um, Then Warriors and um, Free Folk Thens that we are going to gradually upgrade until they are Then Impalers. Um, we have gone north and won a tournament basically everywhere. We've been to Hardhome, we've been to the Frostfangs camp, we've been to the Then Valley. Um, we have fought the White Walkers and captured a White Walker, which I don't know how long it's going to take for him to want to join us, but that is going to be the long-term goal. Um, I wonder what his stats are. Let's have a quick check, shall we? White. Huh. Why aren't there stats available? Let's just have a quick check again. Am I... Ah, okay. So it's two words. White Walker. Let's have a look. Okay, so they're 300 at everything. So, yep, we definitely want him. And that's some that's some pretty pretty beasty armor as well and a very fast horse. Even though the horse is, you know, kind of dead. Good. Right. We'll wait for as long as necessary to be able to get that White Walker. Next episode, what we're going to do is we're going to start heading back down south. Our party is f pretty full at the moment. Um, so is there anything really to be gained by trying to pick up some um, free house noble sons? Probably not. We can see if we can find some in White Ranch. We'll stop off at Winterfell to see if we can have a chat with Rob Stark. The map's still loading. And then we'll just gradually head back here, taking out some armies on the way if we can. Anything we can do to increase our stewardship and increase our party size. Ready to get more Westlands banner, uh, banner Knights. And we are going to, I think, join the war. Um, we're going to begin our whole double agent act and get a contract if we can with Tywin Lannister. Um, and instead of going after the north, we'll probably keep our hostilities focused on the Riverlands. Just so we're near... You know, in and around this area. And we don't want to really kind of... Anything we can do to keep our relationships relatively okay with the North to begin with will be a, a good thing. So I think that's the plan for the moment. So if you have enjoyed this, please remember to hit that like button. Leave your comments in the comment section down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Until the next one, bye for now.